Hello my friends, today I will show you how to clear different kinds of cache on your Windows 10 machine. Please click down here on the uh, Windows Explorer, File Explorer and then click on this PC. Here you see the local drive. Double click on the local drive and if your computer is a little bit older uh, months plus uh, you will see here underneath this folder another folder windows.old which is usually around 1.5 gigabytes so you can delete that folder easily uh, I don't have it I have a fresh install of Windows so when I upgrade this version of Windows one day I will have this folder and I will also delete it okay please double click on Windows and then go down go down go down and double click on software distribution and now you see here a, a, a subfolder double click on download here are downloaded files basically temp files you actually don't need them on this computer let's see how much it is ah you see size 817 megabytes this is quite a lot let's get rid of it yeah let's just okay here right click and delete all right so you just saved on your computer 817 megabytes and now we are deleting the temp files so please click here on the start button uh, right click please click right on the start button and here click on the menu items item run and now this here is opening I have already something in there but let's just type it again please type in percentage T E M P percentage and hit enter okay all these files here and folders they are all temp folders and temp files they all can be deleted let's see how much space I would reclaim let's see and no properties not much 4.48 megabytes okay well at least it's something yeah and when you delete here some temp files which are needed by Windows Windows will just recreate it right now I'm recording my screen here that means I have to keep this folder here and I have to keep that folder here so I don't want to interrupt my recording so and now you just press the delete key do this for all yep continue and do this for all current items try again complete it skip okay these were all the uh, temp files and folders which I was not able to delete because Windows needs them right now but other than that you have again saved space on your hard drive next we are going back to our Windows start button we right click on it again we go to run again and now delete whatever you have here in the text box and now please type TEMP temp without the percent signs and you hit enter and now it says here you don't currently have permission to access this folder no problem just click on continue as admin and there it is so you can get rid of all these here let's see how much we have here size wise properties 1.44 megabytes this is not much but it's something okay so just delete whatever you have here you need administrator permission yes do this for all current items and current and do this for all current items can be couple is open another program so we skip it and now 
is all empty and you have saved about a megabyte of space. Wow! And now we are clearing the location data on your computer or my computer. So please click on the left click on the start button. Click on settings. Please go down here to privacy and then go down to location. Okay, default location, set default, go all the way down and here location history. If location is on, your location history is stored for a limited time on this device, blah, blah, blah. Clear location history on this device, clear. Click on this button and your location history is history. And now let's do the prefetch. Again, Windows Start button, right click, run, and now delete whatever is in the box. And now please type prefetch, P-R-E-F-E-T-C-H, and press enter. You don't have permission, blah, blah, blah. Let's continue with administrator. And so here we are. Here's again lots of temp files. You don't need to have these. As I said, is some of these files are needed. Windows will just recreate them. So yeah, it's let's just select everything. Go down here and then shift. Let's see how much I can save here. 5.13 megabytes. Wow. Well, again, it's something. I say OK. And now let's just delete the whole thing. OK. Close the file and try again. Do this for all current items. Let's just skip. And there it is. It's all empty. It's all gone. You saved again lots of space. Now let's clear all the data from Microsoft Edge. All the other browsers like Chrome down here and of course good old Internet Explorer you can clear as uh, a cache the data of these browsers in a similar way so let's open Microsoft Edge super duper Edge and there we have Google and please click on those three little dots you go all the way down to settings now a new window is opening Please click on Privacy Search and Services and go down here, Clear Browsing Data. You should do this once in a while, it's kind of important. And now Clear Browsing Data now. Click on this one here to choose what you want to delete. Browsing History, Download History, Cookies, Cached Images, that's fine. I don't have any passwords, I don't have any autofill, but of course you can choose all the stuff if you feel like it. Okay, and now clear now, and all done. Yeah, Now your browser is all clean, no more history. Now let's reset uh, the uh, data in your Microsoft Windows Store. Very easy to do, again, you right click on the start button, you click on run, and you type in, get rid of that, and you type in W S R E S E T and press enter. Okay, now it's resetting all the data, all the uh, information on your Windows Store, and this takes a little bit, so give it time. Give it time, you will be okay. Still doing it? Ah, all done. Now your Windows, Microsoft Windows Store is all clean. No more temp files, nothing. Everything is gone. This store is clean. To remove even more stuff from your computer, just please type in here into this text box clean C L E A N and this cleanup press enter. 
this cleanup drive selection so when you have multiple hard drives you can choose which one yeah let's just go with drive C click OK and now it shows me here what can be cleaned up all downloaded programs zero bytes temporary internet files yep here is 5.97 megabytes I can gain and you can choose whatever you like whatever you want to get rid here yeah recycle bin is quite full let's get rid of re recycle bin so you can choose whatever you like I don't want to be that drastic I would like to keep these temporary internet files okay and now click OK. Are you sure you want to permanently delete these files? Yes, delete files. Let's just let it do its job. OK, again, admin permission, continue. And now the disk cleanup utility is removing all unnecessary files.